It's one of the most hotly anticipated debuts at this year's Paris Air Show, Bombardier C Series 300. Beset by technical delays and cost overruns, the company is hoping the show will relaunch the plane to the world's airlines. We're sort of in the home stretch. We've got certification coming up towards the end of this year, entry into service next year with Swiss, so this couldn't be a better situation for us. One of the key selling points for Bombardier is new technology the company is using in everything from cockpit displays to the types of material used. So the airplane has got new technology in the engine as an example, and that allows us to get better fuel burn, which translates into better profitability for our customers. And in this size category, from 100 to 150 seats, this plane family of aircraft is really optimized from an aerodynamic standpoint to deliver that kind of efficiency, which again translates into better cost performance. The company is also the first to use carbon fiber to make the C-Series wing. The company claims these redesigned Pratt & Whitney engines will offer airlines a savings of up to 20% when it comes to fuel costs. But it seems that that selling point hasn't necessarily stuck with airlines. Bombardier haven't seen a firm order of the new C-Series 300 since September. The company's CEO says that current prices don't impact on what airlines are ordering now. Well, in the near term, it's allowing some of our airline customers to make a little bit more money with lower oil prices, right? So that's great news. I think as a former fleet planner in the airline business, the way I think about it is you're still planning when you buy an aircraft or make a fleet decision for the long term. And the one thing we know in this business is that fuel volatility is part of what we have to deal with. This is also the first time that Bombardier is competing directly against the likes of Boeing and Airbus in the twin engine category. It's a battle that Dominic Perry from Flight Global says Bombardier never could really win. Trying to compete directly with Airbus and Boeing is always going to be difficult, no matter how good your product is, because they have the financial leverage to just run all over you. So it's wait and see if Bombardier will seal any deals from Paris. Phil Hahn, CNBC, at the Paris Air Show.